this is obviously my MSL broadcast. You will hear me running my printer behind me when the 3D printer warms up enough. I am actually going to start doing some of my Heroes Fest pulls, so wish me luck. I am recording this for others to see later as well. And special shop. Oh, actually, you know what, before I do that, let me clear space. Since I did get a bunch of three stars, I probably should deal with them right now, initially, at least. And so I can melt that one into the sky. So I'm going to do, I generally don't do all my pulls in a row because I like to free space up for stuff. So I'm actually going to be doing that again, even though I know people don't like me doing that sometimes. It's how I like to do it. Um, just because I don't like having to pull stuff out of temp storage. You have to click it each time you pull something out of temp storage, which you just can't grab everything at one time, which to me is annoying. All right, so here's the first pull. Are you sure? Yes. Uh, sea star. July. I've got to send somebody a text message while this is kicking off. I just literally got rid of one of the bulbies. <laughs> oh, you did that a whole bunch. Get that out of the way. Well, so far I'm batting 100% of nothing. <laughs> Yeti. Four star of Wood Cura. I haven't gotten any yet. Getting a singleton on the four star is pretty weak too. So unless I get a five star on this variant, which is incredibly unlikely. Yeah, All right, cool. You're over in the same chat. All right, so pull number two. No name, you saw how many tries it took me to clear it for my run? And you saw what I used to clear it? I can link the um, video if you want that I put up on YouTube of my run. You don't have a water nightmare? I 
Yeah, you would need to have, I mean, the way the way I was able to force through, okay, I used to see it. The way I forced through it was with a sealer. Um, do you have any units that have a 100% sleep chance? Because the, the other way to try it, hey, there's a four star. The other way to try it is to just try to outright crowd control him with either stuns or sleeps. And you always use the sleeper to hit him last. But he's also really resistant to shit, so he is really difficult. Which is fitting, because I redid the tower and you get a, a five-star egg out of him. Yeah, that will probably help. I've got my light tiger. I need to work on leveling him up. I haven't done it yet. Oh, hello, killer unit hosting me for four viewers. Greetings to those four viewers. Wow, there's two really pitiful pulls. I've gotten two four stars from two Hero Fest pulls. That's quite sad. Hey, KSB. This is only my second pull because I've been waiting to the weekend and today in particular because I was running all over like a crazy person yesterday. So I'm going to be doing more pulls as soon as I make some space. I am actually just going to be melting off pretty much all of these units because none of them are useful ones that I need to hang on to. So let's see if I get some Astro Gem thank yous from them. 100,000, 100,000, 30,000, no Astro Gems, but I'll take the gold because that's useful for me right now. Uh, I'm going to toss those two across. <laughs> I will probably try to get enough natural fives or use enough so that I can Evo 3 one of my Dracos that I have. Because right now I've got my two Evo 2 fires. I've got my one wood, this Evo 1, and I've got my one water, this Evo 2. And actually, that Evo 2 with the double weaken has been really, really useful against the Titans. Dracos coming back for Christmas. It's buried in the patch nose, but he is. I actually predicted that they would do it, too, prior to them putting it in there. What do you mean skip? I like watching my animations to see if I got something. And yes, I believe two Evo 2 fires are better than one Evo 3 fire. That's 30% SP generation right there. If you've got them both running. And it's 50% if you've got a light Persephone, which I do. I run that team sometimes on my PvP. Wow, I got a crap pull again here for the Heroes Fest. A single, I got a singleton again for the four stars, or did I even get a single four star? Wow, what a bad set of pulls so far. Although, Pink Haired Water Miho is pretty cool.
Okay, I've got to take a quick look. Is my Miho water already a variance? Or is she not a variance? She should be. Yeah, she is. Okay. Well, while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and... I did get a four-star the first one. The only useful astromon of that group is that wood crow dude. Crow hook. Ah, oh, no astrogems. Oh well. Toss into storage. And Cinder, don't spoil it if I got a five star because you're watching the chat. I want to see if it actually pops up or not. Thanks. <laughs> four star. All right, maybe I'll get at least two four stars this time instead of one each time. I did watch some of the chat earlier, though. People were talking that they've done, you know, 10,000 worth of pulls and gotten no five stars. And other were like, hey, I got three f heroes, three five stars and less than 8,000 in pulls. So highly variable whether you get anything or not from the hero fests. I mean, I, I understand why they made it so that you can get three of the super... Um, eggs now instead of just the one they want people because people like me once you got that single five star in heroes fest it was never worth it to continue doing pulls because you didn't get any additional reward for it so you would stop being people like me now with there being three they're encouraging you to spend more astrogems which encourage you to have less astrogems which is encouraging you to spend money Interesting. All right. Well, apparently, I got a singleton on the four stars again, and no five star. <laughs> but the crow hooks are starting to come more plentifully, I guess. All right. I've got enough space to do another pull right now, so we're going to do that. Ah, this could be a pull with no four stars. I was complaining about just getting one four star and I've gotten none so far in four pulls on it. Five pulls. Six pulls. Well, the crow, the crow hooks are most certainly making their place known here. So I'm definitely filling out on those guys. Oh, there's a four star. All right, so at least I got a four star for this run. Radis. You know, it's interesting. They actually, as part of the patch, made a lot of the monsters um, should you buy it before anything else? Uh, I would buy the Astro Gems before anything else. The the cost the Christmas shop outfit is going to stay there 
the entire festival. But the Astrodomes, if you buy them now, you'll be able to get them next week also. Oh, I actually got two four stars to this run, so that's at least a better run four star wise. But yeah, the, I would buy the the costume last because you can only can buy that once per the entire event, and the event is another like fifteen days. All right. Well, the Hannah was useful. Storage. You you crow hook, crow hook, crow hook. Over you guys go. Actually, let me toss the vampire over there also. This, come on, astrogems. There we go. 10, 20, 50 astrogems back. So I got a 50 astrogem refund, so that's useful. Toss you across. All right, and back into the shop. Yeah, I bought I bought today the energy, I bought the Astro Gems. Um what else did I buy? I bought one of I bought one of the other low cost ones, but not the costume at this point. So what I really want this festival is a fire Artemis. So that's that's what my goal is, but I actually have to be able to get said critter that to happen. Four star, come on, five star, denied. Yuki, okay, already got my fire super Yuki built. Mowgli. Mini cats. Would that? Medusa. Actually, the Medusa is useful. I need a fire Medusa, though. Fire Artemis, a two-turn stunner with a taunts. No, Fire Artemis is a great late. Um, Fire Artemis is a great late game PvP defense unit. So I really would love to get that two-turn stun because that's an inherent native two-turn stun. All right, so not the greatest of pulls there. A single fire Yuki. All right, so my Astro Gems slowly tick lower. Four star going on five? Nope, not going on five. Yaksha. All right, so this is hopefully a good pull since I got a four star in the first slot. Have you seen or looked at the fire Artemis, Jeff?
you bought the gems with like cash bought the gems come on five star come on five star push but oh deny but it's the second four star so oh you had her at one point why did you choose to get rid of her because had means you no longer have Okay, so three four stars on this pull, so that's at least a better pull overall. Shelly, you don't remember why you got rid of her? Did you melt her into a different Artemis? Another mini cat, and the variant is going to be a three star. Be nice to get like a variant Leo so I could actually make one of my Leos a variant leader and give him a hit point boost. Alright, I'm actually got enough to do the gleams. Oh, but there are. Oh, now that's going to be a tough choice. There's only five days left for a variant Tanya. Whereas there will be. A clan festival before the end of the year. What was Tanya's variance ability? Alright, I need to actually look at this and I need to clear some monsters out anyway, so let's do that first. Um, I can just go to my Tanya real quick and take a peek and see what her variance ability was. Or is she already a variance? In which case it doesn't matter. My overs. There she is. She is not a variant. Her variant leader ability is 30% attack in dungeons, so not all that useful. Alright. And you die. Back to here. You, you, you. Toss them across. From Soul Stones? Nice. Yeah, I, I'm not. In, uh, there's no reason for me to pay 300 Astro Gems to get that. Or 300 of the crystals. Not when I can use the 600 to get the queens that I need to do some evolutions to get more Astro Gems. Release. An egg, some Astro Gems. 40 Astro Gems out of that. That's not bad. Toss those two across. All right, I'm just going to go ahead because I would like to purchase these. I'm going to break from doing the pulls for a moment to do my eggs for the or the gleam purchase. Where they get shoved to? <coughs> Excuse me. There they are. They got shoved way the heck down the list. Is light. I never got a chance to build a Dark Tanya before, so I'm planning on trying to build a Dark Tanya. I knew I was only going to be able to make one Evo 3 in the last festival, and so the Evo 3 that I made was the... Oh, I got one of each element. Interesting. The Evo 3 that I decided to make was the Light Tanya from the last fest. Um, so give me a moment to see who I needed to put these gleams into. Sort by elements. She is an Evo 2. I need to get another Omnioja. I might just hold off on those gleams until I see if I get a 5 star. So we'll just go ahead and toss those over into storage for the moment. Restock soon. Restock right now. Yes, I know it costs a thousand to buy slimes, but if I see slimes or the sparklers for sale for a thousand, I just buy them. Oh, nice. You should be able to get that tomorrow from the. Oh, there's a four star. Maybe five? Nope, not a five.
Well, a Yuki, a four star in the first slot is generally a good sign. Shelly. Mini cats. Pokemaru. A Ramu. I haven't seen many Ramus pop up to today so far. Lats. Mandragora. Four star. I was hoping a five star, but no. A Ramu. So normally the four star in the first lot's a good sign, but then I didn't get any more four stars. And a variant to the end. Oh actually I guess I did I take it back. I did get two. I got the Nike mixed in there. Alright, well I'm cutting it close because I'm not gonna I'll do eighteen hundred, so it's twelve hundred. I've got two more pulls before I've got to stop because I will not go under that. Um, I'll be at 18, I'll be at about 800 left when I finish. So I have had Heroes Festivals before that were complete duds for me where I got nothing useful. I don't have very many eggs to hatch right now, um, Syndra. I'll hatch the ones I have, but I don't have very many. Another Victoria. Because I was, I wanted to see if I was able to pop a Hades out of some of the eggs I'd had, so I opened up most of the eggs the other day over the weekends. For all the eggs the other day over the weekends. Okay, that's cool, Cinder. Come on, five star, come on, push it, push, 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 yay! The five star popped out! Uh, I got a water bast. I do not have a water bast. I have a wood bast. So that's awesome. Yay, I got a five star. So I can hatch a five star egg. And I don't have to go under a thousand astrogens for my pulls. Thank you for not spoiling it, Syndra. <laughs> <coughs> So that was about 5,500 astrogems worth before I got to a five star. Yeah, I really want to make the Dark Noel. Oh, you didn't see it coming? Well, I still appreciate you not spoiling it. <laughs> so now I know where the Water Gleam is going to go on. It'll go on the Basts. Because she will be a awesome healer. Oh, another crow hook. Sweet. Max level. Yay. Alright, so. Let me go pick up my egg. Kratzi. Let's go hatch the egg. Um, I am With that, I'm not going to do any more 10 plus 1 pulls. Um, just because I'm going to save the astrogems so I can actually afford to do runs during the week. Someone pulled a Fire Indra. I'd rather have the Water Bass than a Fire Indra, to be honest. A Fire... I got two Bass! I got the Fire Bass also. Sweet! Both of them are Bass I didn't have before. So that's the Battle Rush Bass. Nice. Now I actually have units I can work on leveling up. So I'll actually have a Bast of each element type. Um, I am going to do, I think I've got enough four stars to afford to do another set worth of the uh, four star critters. So let me pull out the water, the fire. I think I had one more. I have another water right here. So tomorrow I'll actually go to make my water Bast and Evo 2 Basts right on the ball tomorrow. So that's awesome. 
All right, so water bass evolution, you guys pop on in. I actually have had one other time that's happened to me. I had a, I pulled an Arthur and I got another Arthur from the egg. So that's pretty cool. All right, nice. And so she is a one of each and she is, I got both of them are one of each. Awesome, and she's a weaken with a defense boost. Awesome, that is definitely the, one of the bass I wanted to get. The dominance bass for three turns is pretty cool. Um, it, basically, she is a uh, if you're going to use her, she's a PvP type unit, I think. Um, but the water bass is Titans, Colossus, anything you want to defense up and then weaken on them with your healer. So that's I'm actually quite quite happy about that setup. Um, let me go to storage. I'm going to pull out some of the Medusas because I got more than enough to make the fire Medusa thingy that I needed. So one, two, three, pop on out. Fire Medusa evolution, one, two, three. All. All right, awesome. Good luck. I like that her staff has the eyeball that like moves around and checks stuff out. All right, and then storage, we're going to toss in the bow hook. I think this is the only one that's going to get, nope, actually. All right, so I need a clear space here, so we're going to just do this. Good luck on the eggs. Um, I'll do, I'll go check my eggs in just a moment, what I have left. Release. Just some gold. All right, that's all right. I can use the gold anyway. Um, toss her across. You and the Nikes across. Actually, I missed letting you go free, send you free. All right, so 176. Challenges, a little bit of bastard in the back. And incubators. Like I said, I didn't have very many of these normal eggs left at the moment. Five natural fours from one ten plus one. See, you did incredibly better than I did. I did not end up with nearly that many. I got one one four from a four star egg. Or from a three star egg. Three to five. So not bad. Alright. So I think I actually have enough to do another round for the Astro Gems. least those three. Actually, he is a variant. What level variant is he? Level three, increase allies code by 15 plus 2%. That's not bad for a variant. But do I have any Lupons that I actually need to make variants? Probably not. Evo three variants. Evo two. Oh, he's only Evo two right now. Hmm. Probably should not just toss him. I need to look at my Lupons and see what I've got going on there. Astro Guide. Astro Guide survey says some Astro Gems. All right, so the Lupons, I need to see if I've got these at EVO 3 or not, or if there's just at EVO 2. I know the water is at EVO 2. I need to look and see if the fire Lupon is at EVO 2 as well. One of them I've already made. So fire is at EVO 2. Fine. Wood. One of them I made to an EVO 3 already. Okay, wood is already made. So it doesn't matter really which one I do 
to an EVO2. Cat with cleavage? Who, the Lupin? Lupin's a guy. Oh, you're talking about Bast. Yes, Bast is a cat with cleavage. She's an Egyptian cat god. Uh, okay, so then I need to go to my water units. That Lupin. Let's see, yank this Lupin. Okay, then I can toss that one back into storage. So I get more Lupons. All right, now I've got one there right now. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15. All right, so I do have enough four stars to do another or another swing into the drowsies. Summon, oops, nope, that was right. Summon, rebirth, one, two, three, rebirth. Um, I've only seen two today, but I have not done a really long, well, no, I've done, yeah, I've seen two today. I've, generally, the first day of the event, I think that they have a slightly better chance to show up. I have had some other super rares show. So I'm not sure if it's really been nerfed. It's always supposed to be, you know, like, just under legendary for the chance for it to show up. Can I answer my call from my friend Paul? Hey, Hi, Paul. Caught any, or not caught, but have you gotten anything good? Uh, I got a water and a fire bass, so quite happy about getting those two bass. Lucky duck. Yep. I'm right now working on doing mergers of drowsies or into drowsies. I nothing. So I'm going to answer my internet question from KSB. Um, I've got a dark drowsy that I'm working on making Evo 3, and so I just need to get more of drowsies to do it. I would prefer to get a light drowsy mixed in this, because that would be the last one I don't have. How many astrogems did you try spending, Paul, towards it? 3,000 something. Ah, I thought you had more astrogems than that. No, I had 2,600 and I got myself 53. Ah, well, I had to spend about 5,500 before I actually got one. So I was cutting it close because I only had one more pull after that that I could have done without bankrupting myself. Uh, or, or basically basically my red line so I can make sure I can do runs all week and not run out of astrogems. Um, so I'm glad that did not happen like that. I think I've done all of these already to an Evo 2, so it doesn't. Ooh, that guy's three, three squares on it. Maybe I don't want to use that one. I need to grab something. To do that. <laughs> so this is the last. Um, Evo 2 that I need to make to make my Evo 2 dark and do an Evo 3. All 
right, so now we're going to go to Elements, Type, flip down to Dark, Dark Drowsy, take them in, unlock, unlock, Evolve. All right, sweet. So I got my Evo 3 Drowsy. And I'm going to get my Astrogems for having done the Evo 3 on that. And I'm going to do my Lupon Dungeons in just a moment. The only notable thing I got was a Fire Vampire with two squares and a triangle. OK. You didn't get any other interesting four stars besides that? None of no. Oh. Okay. As in like not already. Just plain old low keys and stuff. Okay. Good reward. Uh -huh. I like it. I really do like this game it has the Astro guys. So as you unlock the guys for the first time you get bonuses on uh just oh I did five hundred battles, so there's an egg from that too. You get bonuses for Astro Gems for actually doing an Evo 3 of stuff, uh, especially for the first time you've actually explored it. And go to Summon. So I do have some more eggs to do, so oops, I need to grab the eggs out of the inbox first. After Fire, what's your favorite color to use? You guys want light and dark. Um, I don't use wood, so I use, I use fire and water. Okay. And it's a three star lighter dart. The occults. Colts are useful, nothing else is. Pen pen. Actually, take it back. A dark pen pen actually is useful for me, so uh, we'll hatch these eggs up too. Skip. No four stars there. Storage, one, two, three, four, release. Got some gold. Toss the pen pen across for the moment. Toss him across. The water, bast. I'm just going to toss her across for the moment. I have a recent bought him. Aha, I can bump him up right now. All right, challenges. Got my Astrogen reward and then to the Lupin dungeon. And Daniel, if you're having level issues in. Torchlight. When you set up a world, you can have it re-roll it. What? In Torchlight, if we're having issues with levels, you know how like once you kill the critters in an area, they don't really like come back. Yeah. Well, if you re-roll it, it like resets it. I, I don't need to do that. I'm not having issues with the thing, Paul. Okay. If I if I was, I would do something, but I'm I'm not having issues with it. Have you played some with your dad? I know you showed him your shotgun or something that you got for the game. Yeah, me and him started playing. I put it on the same difficulty we had it at, and I'm going to be lowering it. You're going to be lowering it? Mm-hmm. Why? He's just having trouble. Oh, is he playing a melee type for the game? Mm-mm. He's playing the same type I have. Oh. So why is he having trouble with it? Because he's on Elite and he's just, he hasn't played a type of game like this in a long time. Ah, okay. I'm sure I'll be bringing it back up to that difficulty again. But. I have printing a uh, Stormtrooper Angel. Uh, 
holiday decoration for hanging on Christmas trees. So it's just basically it's a dead stormtrooper that's an angel. <laughs> Dead well, if, 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 if you have a stormtrooper that's died, right? It has little angel wings and a little halo because it's a dead stormtrooper. Okay. Because stormtroopers <laughs> die, right? So when they die, this one apparently was an angel. All right, there's some Talia shards. Some extra energy, useful. One run into the Elusive Thief dungeon. Run number two. While I'm waiting for you, I'm fishing. And okay. I'm doing it myself. That's fine. <laughs> I'm going to be, after I finish doing these uh, Upon runs, I'm going to set it just to be doing normal runs on the map to try getting the exotics to show up. I haven't had a single exotic. Uh, have you been doing runs on extreme mode or normal mode? Normal. Normal? Okay. How quickly are you doing runs on the map? Really quickly. Okay, well, it gives you a time. So how, how fast in seconds is your map finishing? Like 40. All right, well, keep at it. I've had two show up this morning. I killed a couple last night because they didn't want to join me. Emphasis on I haven't had any of the exotics. I had a variant bolt ring, so I haven't had nothing. Well, you had hundred. That's worth a hundred extra gems right there. I know. I missed it the math on um, if I had enough uh, shards to make the crab. Oh, how many were you off by? Uh, a full either two. Mm, yeah, well, that's okay. You can, you've got plenty of time left this month to, to continue. Yeah, but I was hoping to get the after done for. Oh, for opening her up. Yeah. Well, you'll still get it. It'll just be more delayed than you were hoping for. I don't think I'm gonna do, even if I get 600 more, I don't know if I wanna do another full. Oh, yeah, I, if, if you're going to bankrupt yourself astrogen wise, I would say don't. Yeah. I, I mean, I was willing to go down to 800 astrogens, but I would not go down to 200 astrogens. That was not going to happen because then I would have issues trying to do stuff over the week and I would be forced to do sliming and I hate sliming. And so I just don't want to do that. I'm almost level 46. Nice. How long will you start loaded up the world? Uh, I'll tell you. I'm not going to start until after I finish my Vupons, though, because I don't really feel like having Torchlight crash my Vupon dungeon. Okay. Yeah, Sandra, I remember you actually got that Fire Wukong and that Water Balron, and I was so jealous because you got both of those. And I still have not gotten the Water Balron. I'd like to get one at some point. I have a Fire Wukong again, but I do not have the Water Balron. While this Lupin dungeon runs, I'm actually going to go get my lunch. Or get your what? Lunch, something to eat. It's oh. lunchtime.
Hello, Hello, Paul. So what was the Tower of Chaos 70? Um, I'd have to go back and look to see what it was. Um, Sindra, do you do you have the link or did you see me when I did that run? Well, actually, I want to refresh that here. Because I did the run and I uploaded the entire thing to YouTube. I can give you the link again.